He became a close friend of Norm Lindsay, initially through the Bulletin, and they were constant companions. They shared a love of riding, and Lindsay described Fox as an equine exhibitionist. Most unusually, Lindsay painted an equestrian subject, or a fox. It has been a somewhat obsessive, lifelong project of mine to locate the portrait. My initial inquiry in Australia were met with distinct scepticism as to whether Norton Lindsay painted such a subject, as it was so different from his well-known images. However, when en route to Jackarooing in Queensland in 1967, I telephoned Lindsay. Whilst he was too frail to come to the telephone, his somewhat dismissive private secretary was persuaded to put the question to the distinguished old man, who promptly confirmed the provenance. I have a photograph of the painting, with a clearly visible signature, which had been sent to my grandmother in England when the effects of the late George Holman, an art dealer, were sold in Adelaide in the late 1960s. Unfortunately, she could not afford to bid, but through the director of the Art Gallery of New South Wales, I later obtained a watercolour sketch of the portrait. A series of newspaper advertisements has failed to produce a lead for the definitive work, but I remain in hope. Lindsay and Fox had what my grandmother described as a terrible quarrel, the cause of which is obscure. However, Lindsay subsequently wrote to my great-grandfather in England to apologise. I have the letter. I suspect it may have been due to Fox's refusal to reproduce some of Lindsay's more risque images in the lone hand.